Okay, so I am really excited today. Um, I didn't have the best start this morning. I was supposed to get up at noon. Um, I kind of came up with a better sleeping schedule for myself, but last night I stayed up hanging out with my husband and we didn't go to bed until like 6, 6.30 in the morning, which is really, really bad. I need to work on that. Um, excuse me, I'm a little bit out of breath. Um, I got up about three in the afternoon and we were supposed to get up at like one and start um start our workout program together and that didn't happen he had a bad migraine so i wanted him to rest and then i took advantage and i stayed asleep um but i did get up um about three ish three thirty ish um as he was heading out for work and um i got up i had a cup of green tea and then um I was like, I'm going to work out today because I was very serious about what I said. So I started my workout program today. I started DDP yoga and oh my gosh, like I love it so far, um, which I never say that. No one ever says, oh, I love working out. Like I haven't worked out in like a year and a half. So this is like kind of a big deal. Um, and every time I start working out, it's always so hard, like, um, just hard on my body as well as like getting into the routine of any workout because uh usually like if you have, like follow a workout program it's like really hardcore like I used to do P90X like back when I was like fit like actually fit and I couldn't keep up so now as a married woman <laughs> with all this extra going on there's no way I could like keep up with P90X going into it maybe one day but not right now and I don't think I'm ever interested in doing P90X again. I'm not trying to be like ripped. I just, I want to just be more toned. Yeah. Um, so I, um, I, I did it by myself today and, um, I didn't experiment. Um, I wanted to see if I could do it in my room because I have like, it's a bedroom, so there's not like a bunch of extra room, but I wanted to see like how much room I would need around me to be able to do this workout. Um, so I did it in my room and basically the first day was pretty much an introduction video. Um, it was like 34 minutes and uh, in the program there are like 13 different moves that they use. And I um, like the, the whole video was just going through like demonstrating the move, you do the move with them, explains what it does, why they do it, this and that or whatever. So after I did that, I was like super excited. <laughs> um, my arm actually hurts really bad right now from holding the phone. Oh my gosh, it's sore. So um, anyway, I uh, I did the introduction video and then I called my husband. I was like raving about it. Like, oh, I'm really going to like this program. Um, and I was so excited. Like basically the schedule for this week is supposed to be um, uh, Wednesday. I mean, uh, Monday, Wednesday and Fridays. So, like that's the schedule for the beginners um, for the first month. And then you have... Um, Two levels after that so um i did the first the only video i was supposed to do today and i was like i want to do more <laughs> so i did an actual workout video today i did energy and it was i don't want to say it was intense um i got my workout though uh and it was it was good i enjoyed it uh, i was it was simple but it definitely worked like you could tell I was like working on some stuff so that was like 21 minutes and then the introduction video was like 34 minutes so I did like almost an hour working out today kind of in a way um so that's weird for me like nobody's ever like oh I enjoyed that so much I want to do a second workout for the day even though the schedule doesn't say I have to um so I did that which was good I liked it um and what's funny is my next workout isn't supposed to be until Wednesday, which is where I would do technically the introduction video again and then energy again. And the introduction video is there again, just so you can get, you can learn how to do the, um, the poses and the moves um, effectively. But I don't think I want to spend 34 minutes just learning how to do it. I really want to jump in because that's how I am. So uh, probably Wednesday I'll just be doing energy, <laughs> but I'm like, I really enjoyed this. I kind of just want to do something every day now. Like, is it too much if I do it every day instead of three days a week? I'll do it Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Is that too much? 
Am I going overboard? I mean, it's like intense yoga. So it's not like, you know, I'm like doing anything crazy. I'm not like weight training or anything. It's just yoga. So can I do it every day? I don't know. Is that weird? I guess it's not bad that I want to do it every day. I guess it's a good thing because I'm motivated. So um, yeah, I'm really enjoying this program. I'm excited for my husband to try it, see if he likes it. Um, I have high hopes for this. Uh, it's right at my level. Um, I've been wanting to get back into yoga for a long time and work out <laughs> for a while. And this is like the best of both worlds for me. And um, I love that it's not overly challenging. It's like everything, all the moves are simple moves, but they do the job, you know? There's no weights in this. There's no, um, they're not called bungee cords. Um, you know, the court things, the, re the resistant cords, I guess. Is that what they're called? Resistant cords, whatever. You know what I'm talking about. Um, I love that it's just you using your own weight against yourself. Um, so for instance, there's a lot of like dumbbell like moves and stuff like that, but it's resistance. So um, everything is what you can do because your resistance may be different from someone else's. So like if you're actually using dumbbells, like I could probably comfortably lift like 10 to 15 pound dumbbells if I have to, <laughs> not by choice, but if I had to, I could probably lift like 10 to 15 dumb pound dumbbells, like just as a regular workout. But you know, someone else may just be able to lift four pounds. Someone else could probably lift 25 pounds. So usually when I would do workout programs, it's like, okay, and we're going to be using 10 pounds or we're going to be using this particular weight. And it's like, not everyone can do that, especially beginning. Um, so it's nice that everything is based on your own resistance because you can't tell me that I'm not resisting enough. I'm resisting as much as I can for me. Someone else may have a different resistance level um, or preference. So I really like that. I really like like the whole thing in the introduction video was just talking about how um, it was it was a lot of modification. Do what makes you most comfortable. There's a safety zone where, okay, if you need to take a break, stop, take a break in your safety zone. And I really appreciate that. Um, there is not pressure here. And there were times like, and I always, I've always been this way. Whenever I get back into working out, I go hard, like really hard <laughs> the first day. Cause I'm like, yeah, I gotta do this. Um, and I was trying to do that today. And I realized there's no reason for me to go overboard because I can do this. Like, it's not like I have to prove something because all of these moves are something I can do. This is coming from someone who is very unfit right now. Like I will admit I am to not be fit. I've always been a very flexible person, um, like very flexible. Um, <laughs> At one point I could put like my like feet behind my head. Like I'm very flexible. I can't go that far now, but I can probably go about like right here. <laughs> so I'm very flexible, but it doesn't make me fit. I'm just, uh, I guess naturally very flexible. But if I can do that naturally, what can I do if I actually, um, if I actually worked on my flexibility? Um, so, I, uh, I'm really excited about this, like, as you can tell, I'm like, I've been raving about it for eight minutes now. So um, I definitely, definitely have high hopes for it. And even if it gets harder from here on, like, that was just one particular workout. There are like, I think like eight other videos or so, but just the idea of if I'm doing a video that seems like hard, there's so many different ways I can modify it. I can customize it to what makes me comfortable. And I enjoy that. Um, but yeah, that's what I was saying. When I was doing the video today, I was like, I'm gonna go hard. I'm gonna do all the poses right. And it was fine, I was focusing on that. But I also noticed it was like one point where um, I was doing a warrior pro pose and <laughs> we it was like three other things that we had did beforehand. And I was like, my legs are a little bit weak. And there, um, He's like, you know, if you need to, you know, drop down on one knee. And I was like, I don't want to do that. I don't have to do that. And I was like, I'm going to do it. <laughs> so I did it. And I still felt like I got a really good workout. And then once I felt like I had a little more energy, then I went back up to the um, the original um, warrior pose. And 
I just love the fact that even if I have to modify, I don't feel like now I'm not keeping up or um, I'm not getting the most out of that pose or that particular workout. Um, I still feel like I'm, I'm getting a good workout. I just modified it for myself. So anyway, this is not a sponsored DDP yoga video. <laughs> I'm just really enjoying it so far. Um, I've never had a workout program or routine where I wanted to do more that day. Um, so I'm really going to think about it tonight. Like, is this something I want to do every day? Because I'm thinking I do. Like, I don't know, maybe... I don't know. I really want to like, we'll see how I feel tomorrow. If I'm like super sore, then maybe I will just stick to the schedule. But right now I'm like, I can do it again. <laughs> so maybe I need to slow my road, just relax, calm down, simmer down and just do what the calendar says. Or maybe I should push myself. Who knows?